Morning. How you feeling about Molly? I'm feeling she got exactly what she deserved. Morning, Arthur. There she is. How bad of all this mess? Just working on a plan. But just a few blessings left these days. How are you holding up? I'm okay. How are you? You don't look so good. No, I'll be fine. Just worry about you and Jack. I guess. Arthur. Susan? Someone smashed the box. What box? The money box. We'd had that for so many years. Why did they smash it? Well, I don't know. Look at this place. All divided. Everyone anxious and at each other's throats. I'm heartbroken. Yeah, me too. <laughs> me too. All right, well, I should be getting on. As if it matters. Always good to see you. Every morning, I wish I wasn't in this place. How are you doing? This place, it's horrible. Have you seen inside that cave? Oh no, it's only for now. Hang in there. All right then, <laughs> yes, Arthur. Morning, Arthur. How you doing? Been thinking more about Dutch and Eagle Flies. It can only end badly. Now, there's only so much we can do about it. Hey, get up. Sorry. <laughs> it's too tempting.
Who goes there? It's me, Arthur. Well, look who it is. Hey there, Charles. Hello. Morning. Hello. How you doing? Confused? Worried? What's happened to all you boys? Just keep your head down for now. I suppose so. You don't know that. She told us. She was in love. She wasn't said anything. Remember what I said up at the bridge. When the time comes. I will. Because it's coming. Well, I should get back to it. All right then, Arthur. Of course it ain't, but I'm scared. Are you holding up? I'm sure he'll Me turn too. up. He's been gone a while. Me too. Well, he'll be back when he's hungry. Another day. You okay? What is happening to us? Just make this place work, Pearson. For now. Okay, well, let's talk more later. Okay, Mr. Morgan. You okay? <coughs> Peach. You sure? No, I ain't sure. You still working? Is anybody still working? The whole goddamn place full of people bickering, fighting, and lying. It makes me real sad. I know. I need someone to ride with me. To do what? Finish off them of Driscoll's. I hear the last of them is holed up at Hanging Dog Ranch. I don't have it in me no more. I saw Colm swing. I, I just don't care. I was a married woman. You know what they did to me and to my husband. Like you're the only one of these fools that I trust. I've got to do this. I'll tell you what, I'll do it. But there's something you could help me with. Abigail, Jack, John, make sure they make it. I mean, this whole thing is pretty much done. But when the time comes... Or how do you mean? When the time comes, you help them. What do you mean? Help them escape when I... You know, you and me... We're more ghosts than people, but them, they, they could... I know. Of course I will. Thank you, Arthur. You want to ride with me now, or meet me up at Hanging Dog Ranch when you can? <whistles> Thanks, Arthur. Okay, come on. <clears throat> Fine morning for a killing. <laughs> hey. You seen anything down there? Yeah, I think there's a bunch of them down there. I'm mostly drunk. 
For one of them, it's a fat fella with a beard. Him, he's mine. Okay. It's a big ranch. Run down, lots of folk there. But spread pretty thin. I'll set it off and then we'll... We'll take it from there. Take it from there? Okay. No real plan then. Oh, I got a plan. Now come on. Is that a woman? Jesus. Who the hell is that lady? That's the Hellcat saw Colm swing. Now! He was a good man, my Jakey. We was always sweet on one another. I'm sure. Yeah. I miss him every day, every moment. Oh, they turned me into a monster, Arthur. But my memories of him, they still pure. I ain't even got that. 
Aside from my Jake, you're the best man I've known. I know the company you keep. The competition ain't too fierce. <laughs> we, uh, we should get away from her. I think I need to be alone for a bit. I understand. You, uh, might want to get yourself cleaned up. Thank you, Arthur.
Welcome back, sir. Okay, let's take a look at it. Yep. Done. Much appreciated. Lightens my load. Quality hide makes the hardiest clothes around. Don't doubt it. You can start using it now, or I can have it sent to the nearest stable. Thanks, Mr. Get back. My girl. That's a strong looking steed. Hey there, mister. See the roads are getting tougher. Yeah.
Some bastard put put some glass in those trim. Oh, how up. Hey, ma'am. How do you do? Ah, can't be bothered. Hi there, mister. Howdy. Let's not cause no more shit around here. Remember, everyone, I'm your elected official. Your mayor. And you elected me on a tilt as well as democracy. <laughs> this is a fair town, and a nice town, and a proper town. And as such, it's a town for fair and nice and proper people. I see you. This is for you arrange the best, I need a wash. All right, head on over when you're ready. Hey, you need someone to take over for you? Ah, oh, sounds good. Yeah, thanks. Great. Now just sit back and relax. You let me know if you need a scrub anywhere else. Hope I'm not scrubbing too hard. Ah, I do not like getting older. Oh, sure. Oh, I'm glad of this. It's been a hard few days. Oh, you don't say. So, how's it going with you? Pretty good. Just let yourself unwind. So, what do you do when you're not working? Free time, let's see. <laughs> Hard to say since I don't get a lot of it around here. Well, at least this ain't awkward. Oh, <laughs> this is so unprofessional. I'm sorry. Bet you wish I could stay longer, huh? I can tell you're a good person. Oh, I ain't nothing special, please. <sighs> anyway, I'll stop boring you now. Don't you worry about a thing. You're so kind. Goodness. Quite the scars you have, huh? All right. I think I'm good. I sure hope I see you again.
You look fine up. Feeling fresh, I hope? Hey, we're watching you. Don't be starting nothing here again. Is that meant to be a threat? Hey, you need me to shut you up? Because I can give you one back. I'm about to put some holes in you, mister. Say that again. You're gonna I'm bleed! Kidding. Can I help you? Just taking a look. We're with the Appleseed Timber Company. Head farming. We're still getting started on this site, but we should have some fine big valley lumber for sale very soon if you're interested. I'll keep that in mind. We should be further along by now, but what can you do? Wait, <laughs> look at these dolts. There's not a brain between them. Listen, you got any supplies for sale? Food, medicine, starting to run low. I can't spare anyone to go into town, not the way things are going. I'd be happy to pay premium for them. Appreciate it. That should help keep us going. Yep, yep. Yep. Yeah. yeah. I guess I'll settle down one of these days.
you done good, girl. Sir. Ah, sons of bitches. Be quiet. You ain't going nowhere. Hello, mister. Ah, good to see you again. We're moving along here slow as ever, as you can see. Kind of like rolling molasses up a steep sandy hill with these two. If you're gonna do it, do it right. Huh. Tell that to them. I'm gonna get out of here before you try to scrounge anything else off me. Hey, you don't ask, you don't get. You okay, girl? Good work. Yeah. There. Good to see you again, sir. Got everything you need. Have a look. Now, let me have a look. Nice. Same thing. No key then. All right. Appreciate it.
Enjoy. And that should be good. Welcome back. Uh, you you ain't worth two shits all damn lot of you. Hope you ain't hell about it. One tree. Uh, one buffalo. One redskin. I shot 19 of them once. Well, buffalo, not redskins. Don't know how many redskins are killed, but they deserved it. They weren't Christians, so I sent them to hell. Good evening, friend. They should have thanked me. All you fools should thank me. Hello there. What do you want? What's your problem, partner? Yeah, you, with the squinty eyes and the, and the big old head and the women's britches. You! What the hell are you staring at? Uh, you ain't... Hey, hey! Oh, uh, for uh, Christ's uh, sake, uh, can we have one day uh, without uh, five years? Uh, you you put that down and play nice. Why don't you mind your manners, partner? Uh, 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 you want to start a uh, take it someplace else. Uh, uh, That's it. He sure wants some attention, huh? This is the envelope. for this, no sir. Still think you're tough?
Well, howdy, friend. Come enjoy the fire if you like. Howdy. Help yourself, friend. Ain't no bothering me. Are you familiar with Saint Denis? Sure. Now I was just there. Hate the place. All those people. All that noise. Makes me feel like I'm choking. I only went there because there's a feller who pays good money for stuff. Well, he calls it exotic. Egret feathers and the such like don't seem that exotic to me. A thing city folk will pay for. On my way through the main square, I see this big statue of General Quincy Harris, a war hero. War hero? My pa fought under him, said he was a coward who sold out his men. Oh, yeah? He even said there was rumors old Quincy was working for the other side. But, of course, none of this will ever be in the history books. I spat on that statue and I left town and won't be going back there neither. Well, no point in dwelling on it anymore. Ain't the best memory, but I swear I've seen you before. Like this one bit. Sure don't want no part in that. Hope we meet again, stranger. Good luck to you. Easy now. 